gets an idea of how this malicious spyware works in real time. Pranay. Actually, it is very amazing to, to know and the, what kind of data we have access there uh, and to know that how our soldiers are unaware about the usage of the smartphone, how they are falling prey to this entire thing, to understand and to show our viewers that how easier it is to crack a smartphone where you store almost all your data. It's like an open book of your life. So we, have, we are joined by here Amit Dubey, who is a cybersecurity expert, and he knows how to crack this thing and will show uh, I am giving uh, my phone for, for his, his usage. And we want to, to see that how it is easy to crack that system to crack and hack this smartphone. So Amit. So hello, Pranay. And uh, I took this challenge to hack his phone in less than two, three minutes. And this is just to tell you that how easy is it. And before I tell you more about uh, the available open source and softwares and applications, because as we have already covered in the story, uh, there are some very, very simple uh, scripts that you can use to hack a phone. For example, I'll just send an SMS to Pranay's phone. Pranay, you can just open your phone. Yeah. I just have his number. I'll send an SMS, and there is a hidden link inside. As soon as he clicks that link, a Trojan will get installed in his phone. And within a fraction of seconds, his phone will start sending me his phone records, call details, calling data, and images, videos, everything to my cloud or server. And I can show you here that what is there in his phone. Now, this we can achieve in less than two to three minutes. And that's why it is very, very important to know that whenever you are getting a message or a WhatsApp image, where an image is hidden in an image, and they ask, like, if you click this image, you will get some miracle or something. At that time, you should be very, very conscious because there might be some hidden link inside that. Though you are clicking it just for fun, but it will damage your phone. It will uh, compromise your phone and your information. So uh, let's just start it here, and I'll just send an SMS to, uh, to Pinay. OK. I'm watching my phone. Yep. So here we go. Okay, yes, I have received. And there's a simple link, you'll just click it. It will definitely not open because there is a script inside, it's not a web page. So I open, click this link, it says an open URL. And, and, and he says. does not know that his phone has compromised now. And, so, and you can see that uh, the HSDP, the data services, start sending some information to my server. Okay. So we'll just wait for a few, few minutes and we'll see that his entire phone will be available to with us. There's all SMSs of today. We can see it over here. <laughs> oh, please. We'll show all my details. <laughs> this is how anybody who uses a smartphone so can I'll fall victim to it. These files. Mm -hmm. So these are the two files that I have created in my script. Those are received from your system. Let's see the call, call backup. And here is your call details. You can see that I'm getting the names. I'm getting the time of call, the duration of the call, in, incoming, outgoing, everything. Okay. And this is off today. So, and it's very easy just to hack a phone in a few minutes and get all these details. This is really amazing. Yep. Is it that easy? It's so easy. And believe me, like Android guys or Google guys are working hard to make their phone safe. They, every now and then they are releasing new OS. But I don't have any hesitation to share this, that hackers are much, much more smarter than the Android developers. So before they launch an OS, a new OS, we are already ready with a new script, a new Trojan that can be installed uh, and that can, uh, uh, that so can pass through me, any antivirus or anything. Without me even knowing that I have already compromised my phone, this phone can be taken on remote. Exactly. And you will never get to know that your data is with me. You will always be uh, worried like why I'm paying too much uh, internet bill or why my phone is getting heated because your data is getting uploaded to my server every 30 minutes. So if when so, you see the phone is getting heated, when you know why you're getting the excess, you're, you're unable to understand why you're getting excess bill, please be aware your phone could be compromised and this is how easy it is. It is a great threat. It's a big threat for the national security as well as the individual privacy of every individual citizen who uses a smartphone. This is a really real threat to our security also. All right, it's shocking. I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm actually stunned by the matter-of-fact nature in which 
all of this has happened in a space of two to three minutes where just a simple SMS with a link on it and you click that link, all you get, by the way, is a very innocuous message saying this page cannot be opened. But